Hello everybody, it's me, and welcome back to another video. Now, I know this is kind of a short video, and it might seem like I'm kind of just trying to get something out, but I wanted to record a Doodle World showcase, but I had a pretty busy Saturday. Let's just say I had a pretty busy Saturday, and I'm only just able to get this little bit of content out. And I would go and do Do the Doodle World showcase I have planned, but... I cannot find any battles past like 7 a.m. or no, 7 p.m. It's like impossible. I one time spent like an hour trying to find one battle. It was absolutely horrible. But anyway, you're here for one of maybe a few reasons. Maybe you just want to see what's up and what Jamie has done. Jamie has done the greatest thing on earth. Remember this? Remember this, Lumion? Is that a health amulet? Why does that health amulet? Yeah, I'm just dumb. That's what it is. Hello. Hello. And I'm about to unpause. Oh, you're a kid. You know where they charge you for? Hmm? And they charge you for uh, like an Nintendo Switch charger? <laughs> That's mine. Hold on. Yeah. Remember this completely broken thing? It has been nerfed. Not as a, as of right now, which I don't think. But if you're wondering why Oxidrake is completely broken, um, let me let me pull you, let me pull something up for you. <laughs> I know it might not look like much, but I'd like you to look right here real quick. Look at the weaknesses or the resistances of Oxidrake. Resists water, plant, ice air, bug, spirit, mind, and typeless, right? Now, that would not be super horrible, and it's a pretty good defensive type. Then you look at its weaknesses, light, earth, and brawler, uh, two of which are really good, one of which isn't really good, and light being the one that's not very good, earth is probably one of the best typings in the game. Um, brawler is good, but it the two things Oxtrake's weak to have immunity. So if you've got a plant type like Chartiki, you're fine. Get a spirit type like Revenine or Vesperatu, you're fine, right? So only earth types are usually going to be the move to hit it, right? But there's so many things that resist earth. Like Harv is an okay teammate. And that's just one on top of my head. Like Harv, Chartiki, and Oxidrake. That sounds horrible. And then you go to look at its, the, the resistances, right? It can hit all but two all but two of these it can hit plant it can hit ice it can hit bug spirit mind and typeless it has bamboozle so that's already being able to hit mind and plant it has driving force so that's, that can be able to be hit that can hit ice and bug or not ice ice and bug and then it has fighting which is it hits typeless bug and ice again and then it has ancient which hits spirit so realistically only air types or like it can hit all the things that resist it i think it can hit six to eight things that it resists which is insane and then you look at the stats it has good health right really good melee attack really good melee defense okay range defense it's just a full in melee thing right it can use very clever with bulk up and that's kind of the thing I'm using right here. This is the set that I'm using right now on Oxidrake. I'm not sure. I'm not sure if it's outdated, but I've just been using it. I don't use Oxidrake anymore, and it just likes probably gonna get melee attack, and it's really horrible. And I hate that I use it, but 
<laughs> anyway, where? how did I get here? All right, now you also might be thinking, well, things can counter it. Like, you can just get a brawler type, you can just get a teammate. This thing is really hard to kill. Now, you might think, oh, well, it doesn't have rejuvenate, or it has a healing move, right? It does get rejuvenate. It also gets bulk up and steel crusher, which it doesn't use steel crusher. It's just crazy. And it also gets driving force. Or it did. That's what I'm here to talk about. Now, in the Lumi Legacy General, just recently, like I think a day ago, Jamie said he's going to replace Driving Force in Atlantean, I hope. Another another thing about Octite, which makes it so, so good, is the combination of Ancient and Fighting, right? Um, things that resist um, Ancient like light um and metal brawler can hit one of those right and it can basically always get a free swap because spirit types don't want to come in versus it because it can hit it with an outburst which is a 125 strength move it's just Octrake's dumb Octrake is stupid and i don't know why it was given so much love i mean it gave it got a redesign which is good but like it just wasn't it just is too good and that's why I'm happy Jamie announced this. Anyway, I'm just gonna replace Driving Force with Rough Up on Octric and Cop Raj. We aren't leaving the old Octric Drakes and Cop Rages with Driving Force. The old move, the move will no longer exist for future and current ones. Now, you might think, why, why, why does that matter? You know, it's a stronger move, it'd be better. But being able to force switches in a bulky meta game is more important than you would think. Because a lot of things in this game in PvP wise are able to have good switches, right? And being able to force one of them and also making sure spirit types can't come in versus your forceful switch makes it really good if you just stack up damage with say broken barbs, right? You can use icicle traps, you can use poison barbs, you can just use barbs in general. And Octodrake is such a good teammate for Lamello because it can force those switches and spirit types do not want to come in versus it because it resists spirit. And not many spirit types can hit this thing back. Your soul's the only exception, which I think is the only thing, the only spirit type you can hit Oxtrick back for super effective damage is your soul. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I'm pretty sure that's it. No, Harv. Harv. Harv works. But, yeah. Overall, I'm really glad that this change was implemented into the game. It makes it, makes Oxtrick so much less scary to fight, and it's gonna make, prop, it's gonna hopefully make, um, Oxtrick less common, because it is really good on things like, uh, like Luminami, like Varibus Luminami with very clever Oxtrick is such a good defensive core, it's insane. Luminami just flash and fleece, gets its health back, Oxtrick can come in and just, just rack up damage with barbs. Pair, if you pay, right now, if you want to use a really, a, just off the top of my head, if you want to use a pretty good, uh, pretty good, uh, driving force based team, you could use something like a Ignorant Wrestling, um, Luminami, Oxidrake, Lumello, and then three others off the top of my head and just spam driving force till there's no tomorrow right that'd be kind of cool but don't do that because that sounds horrible and i would hate it anyway <laughs> hopefully you guys did enjoy me talking about like octa drake in general and hoping that eventually it's gonna get nerfed which i'm happy about rough up it getting rough up one more thing i want to talk about it getting rough up is a big nerf to it because before it was able to force switches now it really can't right it can now just hit metal types and such for super effective damage so overall it's a pretty good pretty good nerf to octa drake all it needs now is to get rejuvenate taken away and suddenly this thing's gonna be like nu it'd be hilarious <laughs> anyway hope you guys did enjoy the video see you guys in the next one Bye bye